Hey guys, I'm Julie and today I'm going to tell you guys what's inside of my bag. Personally, I love these type of videos, probably because I'm really nosy, but I just like seeing what other people are carrying around with them because it kind of makes me think like, oh, I could totally use that and like carrying that around with me would make my life so much easier. This is my bag right here. It's actually a crossbody bag, but um, I prefer it without the strap, so I usually just carry it around like this. I got it from a store that I don't necessarily agree with anymore, so I'm not going to tell you guys where I got it from. So this is just an inside look at like what the inside of my bag actually looks like. So as you can see, it is absolutely stuffed with so much junk, um, and I'm just going to randomly pull different items out and tell you guys what they are. Okay, this is my phone. It's an iPhone 7. This is what my case looks like. So my case is from eBay and it's a character in like this really popular franchise in Korea. I love this phone case. The reason I actually got this phone case is because, first of all, it's cute as fuck. But the real reason why I got this phone case is because of this. I looked at so many different phone cases that um, had a little card holder in them and they were not cute, but this was really cute. and. I've had this for like a year now and it's still holding up, it's still in good condition, so what can I say? Okay, let's see what else we pull out of the bag of mysteries. Oh, duh. This is my wallet. It took me forever to find a wallet that I really liked. Sometimes, maybe I do want to carry a tiny purse, or sometimes, maybe I don't want to carry a purse at all, and I really hate those like really big and bulky wallets that you have to like zip open and I just, I don't... I don't want to deal with all that, you know? Like, I just want something that's easy that I can whip out and use, and I really do think that this wallet's great for that. I don't really carry cash with me. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't know if it's a bad thing or not, but it's never been an issue before as long as there's an ATM nearby. Okay, next thing is. Let's. Uh, I can't. I know what everything is just by like touching it, so this kind of defeats the purpose of it being a surprise, but here are my headphones. <laughs> They're super tangled up because I don't I don't keep them in like a little like case or anything like that, but I probably should. These are just some really cheap uh, headphones that I picked up at I think it was Micro Center. They have these kind of ear things right here, and if you're listening to really loud music like I always do, I get really shy about people knowing what music I'm listening to. With these, it's very discreet, so nobody knows what I'm listening to, and I love it. These are my sunglasses. Uh, I just have them protected in this little Fermu thing I got. This is like a cloth I got from like the first time I ever worked with a brand, which was a very long time ago. I know you're all probably very confused as to why I have sunglasses when I wear <laughs> prescription glasses. I wear these in my car on top of my, my prescription glasses. And you know what? I might look stupid, but I don't care. Um, nobody sees me when I'm driving in my car. So it doesn't cause any issues for me. I just, I'm sad because these glasses are so cute. I can't wear them out in public because I'm going to look like like this like I don't I don't want to look like this I actually want you guys to guess where these glasses are from I'm gonna like tell you in like one two three four wait <laughs> one two three four five they're from the 99 cent store I know guys they look so expensive but they're they were literally one dollar and that is amazing um, this is my lip balm. It's by Burt's Bees. I actually don't know how long I've had this, but I should probably know that. I don't... Does lip balm go bad? I've had this for so long now. I actually don't really like this lip balm. It's like, it's whatever, you know? It's just... It's okay. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't have much to say about that. Okay, next thing is... Phone lenses, because I'm trying to be a vlogger, but I suck at it. <laughs> okay, guys, no, for real though, if I make vlogs, please watch them, because I'm just afraid of making a vlog that nobody wants to watch and not knowing what I'm doing wrong. If I make a vlog, I want you guys to watch it, and I want you to tell me whether it's absolutely horrible or not, because I actually want to make vlogs that are really good, and I want constructive criticism so I can take that feedback and make my vlogs better. So I have a wide angle lens and this is just for my phone camera because I actually like using my phone to vlog. Oh my god. I like using my phone to vlog because I don't want to be that bitch. <laughs> I mean, 
And there's nothing wrong with vlogging, but in Houston especially, like, people would be really freaked out if they just saw me carrying a camera with me everywhere and recording stuff. We clipped this onto your phone camera and it just gives you a better picture, like, um, it doesn't improve the quality of, like, the video footage, but it does give you, like, a different perspective on it, like, you could get those, like, really wide shots if you really want to show off a lot of things, or you could do the fisheye view if that's what you're into, so, I just carry these around with me everywhere, it's easy, it's functional, and I, I would recommend these, they're great. I just want to have a reusable bag on me at all times so that like I can just whip it out and I don't have to like, you know, waste plastic. These are really great because they can just fold up and you can easily carry them with you anywhere you go. Okay, next out of the bag of wonders, we have my hand compression glove because I have terrible wrist problems. I don't know what's wrong with me. I might have carpal tunnel. I might have a ganglion cyst. I might literally be dying. Um, not having health insurance sucks. We're not talking about that in this video, but no. Uh, I just carry this around with me whenever I'm having wrist problems because sometimes my wrists will just randomly start hurting like a lot and I don't know what to do. Like, so I just keep, I put this on my hand and it kind of takes some of the strain off my wrist and I'm able to feel a lot better. So yeah, if you guys have random wrist issues like I do, I would recommend getting a little glove like this. Okay, and next we have this, this right here. So I am such a nerd over like things that are multifunctional. Like if something can do two things, I will instantly love it twice as much. This right here is a compact, so you can do makeup touch-ups or you can brush your hair. My hair gets frizzy really easily and it also gets tangled very easily even when it's short, so this brush right here is so important for me. Having a brush with me on the go has just changed my hair game so much, guys. And yeah, I love this so much because it's, it's multifunctional, you know? Like, I can touch my makeup up and then I can also, like, brush my damn hair and it's great and I love it. And it's millennial pink with, like, blue text and pink and blue is such a nice color combination. Guys, this is amazing. I love this. This is just a strap for my bag. Sometimes if I want to go hands-free, I will put the strap on it even though it's not as cute. Okay, keep going, keep going. Oh, I have a pen. I carry pens with me because when I was younger, I was like obsessed with carrying purses. Like I've been obsessed with the idea of having purses since I was like six years old and I used to have a little baby pretend purse that I would carry with me everywhere, probably looking obnoxious as hell, right? But my father was always like, do you have a pen? Cause like, he would assume like, you have a purse, bitch, don't you have a pen? Like, what the hell are you carrying in your purse if you don't have a pen? So I feel like this is just like a common sense item. Like, I don't wanna have a purse full of junk and not have a pen and feel stupid. So this is just by Muji. Muji makes amazing pens and y'all should really check them out. Okay, next we also have more vlogging equipment, yay. So this is tripod for my phone. Um, it's, you, it's not supposed to be like this, you can just put it together, but um, I love this because it's so compact and easy to carry in my bag with me. Okay, and ooh, this is interesting. This might be a little bit controversial, but you know what, bitch? This is not a big deal. So this is pepper spray. If you live in some countries, or like if you just live in an area where pepper spray is illegal, don't carry this in your back bag. I don't want you guys to get in trouble for carrying something you're not supposed to. I don't know how to use weapons, so I don't like to carry that stuff with me just because like, if I don't know how to use it, I feel like it can easily be turned against me and I don't want that to happen. But with pepper spray, like, this bitch at least knows how to use this. Um, so I just carry this with me and I have never had to use it before, but you know, I do go to school, I'm in college. You know, there is occasional crime that happens and you know, sometimes I am at risk and I just like to have this on me because it gives me that sense of security. Last few things, scrunchie, and in my scrunchie, I like kind of wrap it around itself and I carry hair clips. So yeah, my hair is getting long enough that I can like put it up again, and I love scrunchies. I'm just all about them at the moment. This one is from Dollar Tree, because your girl loves to save money. 
Um, it is this beautiful navy blue color because I just I love the way that navy blue looks in my hair. So I just put my hair up whenever it's in my way. I want to focus on something or I don't know. Maybe I decide to randomly go work out. That never happens. That never happens. But who knows? Maybe it will one day. And. I want to have this with me. And I just carry my hair clips for the same reason. I just want to get my hair out of my face maybe. Maybe I don't want to put it up, but I want to get it out of my face. These are rose gold. I think they're actually meant for blonde people because they're supposed to like fade in with your hair, but I don't like to hide my clips. I like to kind of use them as an accessory. These are by Scrunchie. They're super nice. I have some rollerball perfume. Um, this is by Pacifica and it is their perfume Sugared Amber Dreams. I love this perfume so much. I think this is my second bottle of it. I smell like a freaking cupcake when I wear it. And if y'all don't want to smell like cupcakes, that's a shame, honestly. And the last thing your girl needs, because you guys all probably already know this just because you can see, but I have no lips. Having lip liner on me is a must because you know, it's just sometimes I want to kind of pump them up a little bit, make them a little bit fuller, you know, let people know that they exist. Sometimes my lips just like fade in with the rest of my face and people don't realize like that I even have lips. So carrying this with me is super great because it kind of reminds everybody that I do have lips. That's everything that's in my bag, guys. Oh my god, my bag is empty now and I have to put everything back inside of it. And my camera battery is dying, so I guess it's a good thing that I finished this video when I did. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will see you guys in my next one. Okay, bye.